What's up, YouTube? Figured I would start a series here since I need to show you guys what's been going on with the cows anyways. See, here we have this uh, cover crop. It's a little 20 acre spot and we're gonna graze it down some. We still wanna leave some cover on it for the uh, get through the heat of the summer and stuff. But if you can see the tree line up there, that's where I'm going. And into the corner where you see it, green stop. And then all the way down here anyways i don't know if i've ever showed you guys my uh the way we kind of set up these fences but we take a t-post and drive in and then we drive in a dead man and then we i put that post there in the center to keep that wire from being able to untwist and this doesn't have any tension on it yet but when it gets tension on it it'll pull that back against the barb and anyways then you just tie on well last time that we picked up fence I made a mistake and I forgot that this, there's some of these wire rollers that are one piece, or these, the spool that are one piece and there's some that are two piece. Well, I thought this was a uh, one piece and I took it off. So they're supposed to be about this wide and this thing's popped open that much further. Cause here, I'll show you the, here's the bolt that uh, goes on there and holds your spool on. So what I did was I found this piece of all thread, threaded it in and found a couple washers. And I got a, I mean, that thing was, it was sticking out this far. So I think now I'm just gonna go slow the little while and then I'll come back and tighten this nut up again and just keep going from there until I get all this wire corrected. You know, usually with a two piece, you're supposed to tie it here to here on every one before you take it off. But with a one piece, you just wrap your tail around this and that holds it but anyways so what we got to do is like i said keep doing that and then keep do tightening that as we go down the every section that i do i'll do it once I'll, I'll run this section and then i'll tighten it and i'll be able to see from these vice grips that's actually something handy i may keep that uh rod so that i don't have to bring help with me to tell me if i if i if my wire tangles up for whatever reason because it's easier to watch the the vice grips in the rearview mirror than it is to uh listen for somebody and anyway so i'll run up up four sections and i'll keep tightening that nut until i have that corrected and then i guess what i'm going to do i got over the hill i grazed cattle here in winter on the milo stubble so over the hill over there i still have my water tanks so i got to get all this little uh i got to get all this set up the fence and everything and i'm going to go over here to my neighbor he's a friend of mine and and i'm probably going to be able to get water and electricity for my charger from him and uh get all that set up but there should be some really good grazing in here for the cattle this is uh oats and then this is like uh turnips or something but i'm sure the cattle will eat this up and we will uh that's what i'm gonna do i guess i'll bring you guys videos as i go i'll probably upload this one now and then i'll upload a video of what the fence looks like put up and then another one when i put the cows in so just keep following if you are interested in this and we'll see how it goes. This will be my first time grazing any cover crop. So fingers crossed that it all goes good. Peace out guys.